Hi guys, this is Nathan Chronicle 5952, and I am doing a book review. Actually, it's not a book review. I'm just telling you guys that this book is going to be finished today, tonight. I'm going to do a book review later tonight. On a before book book review on City of Bones, and I'm going to read that by tomorrow. Right now it's 6.59 a.m. in the morning. 7 a.m. And I'm going to school soon. Now I'm on page... ...185. This only has 400 and... Seventy six pages, so yeah, it's a good book. I, I recommend the Fable Haven series. I'm just gonna read the summary quick to see if you like this book. <coughs> Very strange things are afoot at Fable Haven. Someone or something has released a plague that transforms beings of light into creatures of darkness. Th Seth discovers the problem early, but as the infectious disease spreads, it becomes clear that the preserve cannot hold out for long. In dire need of help, the Sorcerers question where to turn. The Sphinx has given them given sound advice, but is he a traitor? Inside the quiet box, Vanessa might have information that could lead to a cure, but can she be trusted? Meanwhile, Kendra and the members of the Knights of the Dawn must journey to a distant preserve and retire. Another hidden artifact. Or er, achieve another hidden artifact. Well, the so Society of the Evening Star recover it first. Will the plague eclipse all light at Fable Haven? Dun dun dun. <clears throat> yeah, well. That's the book. And then, you know what book I'm going to read next. That series up there. Oh, it's heavy. Kind of. Got it for my birthday. Got a Barnes Noble gift card. I'm gonna have to buy another book. Since I have a Barnes Noble gift card, I'm asking you guys what book I should buy. You recommend me a book. I'll do that in the next episode. Ethan Conquer 5952.